So you've just wrapped up a review game or you want to look back at a past game to see how your students did. Well, we've got you covered with Blue Git Reports. I'll show you how to find and make sense of your reports. And at the end of the video, we're going to go over some creative ways to use these reports to create new sets for further review. To view a report after a live game, simply click on the View Report button in the top right corner of your screen when the final standings are being displayed. To view reports from past games, go back to your BlueKit account and click on History in the side navigation. This will display a preview of your recent games. Select one of them to see its full report. Now, these are really similar to the homework report, so if you've come here from the homework video, click on Homework in the side column and follow along with the rest of this tutorial. All reports will contain basic information like the question set title, the date of the game, percent correct for the entire class, the number of players, the number of questions answered correctly and incorrectly, and the option to delete your report. Now beneath that, you'll find a leaderboard with more details for each player. You'll see their percentage correct, the blue that they used, their nickname, the number of questions they answered correctly and incorrectly, and any other information and details relevant to that particular game mode. In this case, it's gold earned. These reports are really helpful to see a bird's eye view of how the class is doing as a whole and which students might need some additional support or review. But BlueKit Plus subscribers have access to enhanced reports. If I view the same report after upgrading to Plus, I will now have the ability to download this report as a spreadsheet and you'll see an entirely new section breaking down the correct and incorrect answers by question. You can even sort this by question number or incorrect percentage. From this view, you can quickly identify themes, trends, or even types of questions that might be worth reviewing for the whole class. Additionally, Plus subscribers will also be able to view the exact questions that students answered and how well they answered them. This is particularly helpful as you conduct more formal assessments with BlueKit. Now, we all love reports and data is great, but how can you actually use these? Well, I suggest playing another game with the same set and compare their progress over time, or maybe review the types of questions that were most frequently missed at the beginning of the next lesson. And for you teachers who are power teachers and want to take this to the next level, you can use the question bank to create a review set for all of those questions that your students might have struggled with the most. Simply open up another browser window. I find this best to have them both open at the same time and click on create in the side column. Add the title for your set and then click create. Teachers with a free starter plan can enter questions manually by clicking the add question button. BlueGit Plus teachers can use the question bank and add questions directly from their sets or any other public set. Click on question bank to start adding questions. You'll see your question sets in the side column so you can open up that question set that you just played that game with and add those questions. Or you can even search for other question sets that are available to everyone and pull questions in there. So once you found the questions that your students answered incorrectly, press the add question button to add them. Once you're happy with the set, click the X in the top corner or set creator page in the background and select save set. You're now ready to play another game or assign this as homework using these buttons here. To learn more about the question bank, click on this video right here and to learn more about assigning homework and accessing those reports, watch this playlist right here. And if you don't have Blue Kit Plus, we've got a link in the description below. Check it out. We highly recommend it. Either way, we'll see you in Blue Kit and we'll see you in the next video.